Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Yo, I hope y'all doing good. It's Saturday here. It's nasty, rainy, gloomy, whatever you wanted to say. But yo, I'm in a good mood. My family's healthy. I'm healthy. Um, you know, my seizures, anyone that knew before two years ago I had a seizure. I've been good. I've been healthy, man. I can't complain. Uh, I just got a text from the body guy, the new body guy, and he told me I can come down and take a look at the car. Plus, I also got a drop off a deposit. You know how that is. Um, so I want to take you all down there. I think the car, well, the video I saw last night, the car was taken apart. So maybe it is still taken apart, but let's go down there, take a look. Let's see what this gent looks like right now. All right, I'm going to take you all with me so you all can see it same time i do all right i hope y'all are ready for this guys um from the video this one looks good if you could see in my last video when the body guy sent me and the way i was speaking i was very skeptical i was not sure the video was dark it was very gloomy but this one looks crazy from the video he said the lighting in there was terrible supposedly but it looked crazy let's go take a look at the m3 all right before we head out, I had to show you guys my daughter's shirt. Look at that. Too easy. It was Moses there, but you, you experience it. <laughs> it's an old shirt we made for her because she's so smart, man. And everything in school is just too easy. Right? Yeah, let them know. Anyway, we're on our way out. Pick back up later. So before we even get to the car, I had to send you guys the footage. Um, the body shop sent me. You see them completely removing the car, stripping everything down the way it should have been. This was supposed to be a touch-up paint job from the first shop, turned into a complete full paint job. They hope. As you can see here, this is a picture of the car fresh out the booth, and it already looks glossy. You see them walking around, you see the lighting shining off the car. Everything looks beautiful, and it, it's not even wet, sanded, um, compound, nothing. It's just straight out the boot. I give them credit for this. I was excited after seeing this one right here. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is raining, but I want to show you guys the car as it is. They brought it outside, which I didn't even know, man. This is carbon fiber. That's crazy. But outside in the rain, how wet looks beautiful. They took off everything. All the moldings, everything was painted separately. Everything, guys, like all the, the messed up moldings that was here. All that stuff painted inside. Yo, they did an amazing job bringing this car back to life. But again, I didn't know it was going to be this nasty outside. So we're going to come back <laughs> to the car again. <clears throat> Excuse me when it's nicer outside but just to give you guys a preview of what's to come this joint is going to look absolutely beautiful man but we out ladies and gentlemen happy monday happy monday we have some new parts to drop off for the uh, e46 m3 since they were going ahead and making everything brand new i thought it was only right we replace the the, the grills you know uh it's nothing crazy open this just black uh you know the thing about these aftermarket grills man sometimes they fit properly sometimes they don't hope it just fits so i'm gonna drop it off at the shop um they're gonna throw it in since they already have the grill out and hopefully everything should look brand new so take care with me while we go down there and drop it off uh, maybe get another walk around of the car. I think it's put back together. And um, that'll be that. Hopefully the car should be coming home this week. 
and content continues all right peace in true moses experience fashion that the grill loaded up gym bag drop off gym let's work all right ladies and gentlemen here is the car with the stuff put back on and i'm going to go in and critique everything okay a little bit of dust a little bit of dust comes off it looks amazing filthy of course but all of the trim pieces are put back on but the body work looks beautiful looks beautiful it's dusty because i assume they are working around even look here yeah, in here before had like let me try to get y'all in because it's a tight area had like overspray from the other shop they got all that out he even redid sanded and redid the the um bumper clear coat looks amazing man looks really good tight areas but not gonna mess up his work mess up his stuff but just want to give y'all a quick quick overview all right a little bit of dust look at the front lip see if i can uh see if i can put the light on for y'all give you guys a there you go yeah he brought this drum back to life man just check in here none of those overspraying the creases everything is on solid it looks beautiful I'm loving it loving it loving it loving it can't wait till everything is done they're gonna wet sand buff and all that stuff obviously in here it's being used as storage right now oh my gosh looks crazy but i know they're gonna get me back right i ain't worrying about it but yeah this is it so far bring y'all back the update uh after the car probably should be next next update should be when the car is complete honestly i don't see anything else left except for them wet sanding and compound but yeah all right later all right guys i am not excited to be making this video but i wanted some clarification before i showed the video so i got a call from the shop today explained to me that everything was pretty much done but something unfortunate happened <laughs> um it's no fault uh to the shop it's not something they, that was purposely done um and we're already on it the replacements already been ordered and once they come in they're gonna install it and all that stuff so just to give you guys the context i'm not blaming the shop not at all my car is low. It was an accident. They took responsibility, called me right away and said we want it. We just want to make sure that you knew and you choose the one that you want. So just to give you guys some context before I show you the next video. And I appreciate the shop calling me right away and taking responsibility and helping on it. But anyhow though, they sent me the video, the car kind of wrapped up. Um, I'm going to include it here. So you guys can see but i'm not going to be picking it up right now because of the situation <laughs> but i'm going to input the video here you guys enjoy all right i'll see you on the next one man terrible news this car was finally done man going up this little stoop because i'm moving cars all right it hits against F broke man so what i'm gonna do is remove the bumper spray the bumper so that could go out and um just let me know let's let's find the carbon fiber lip and let me know man i i gotta be responsible for it no got it boss quick overview sucks there's no bumper on i know it looks rough but i mean no bumper Looks naked. I polished the trunk too to take out majority of the scratches as best as I could. 
The wrap I can't polish on the top. We're gonna wax it. You can't. I don't think I could buff like you know compound wrap because I think it might burn the um the vinyl. So that's why I don't even want to mess with it. But I mean everything is flawless. Sucks, man. I know. From bumper. Oh, your emblem. I don't know if we're gonna put the same one because it's 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 pretty nasty. These I had to adapt because it wasn't closing. Because it was touching too close. So I guess that's for the supercharger most likely, uh, the intercooler. So I had to kind of cut them up, slice this up over here and it, everything closes is good. Well that's, that was because of that. And this is the crown jewel right here man. Yeah. 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 Pulled up on a op block, hit the opposition with the chopper. 